we have to say, right, we're not doing this anymore. Everybody out. Everybody civil disobedience. That's it. We're not doing this anymore. Yeah, um, it is noticeable that um, a lot of people, even in the movement, there is this sense of, oh, it's not too bad now. Um, there is an, there's an element of that. And uh, there is also an element of, while we've got this window of opportunity, you know, let's go to the coast. Let's have a holiday. Let, let, let's, let's go to the restaurant. Let's go to the pub. There's an element of that. I've done a bit of that myself. And, you know, a, few, a, a week or two ago, I spent three days doing what I should be doing, which was going to Silverstone to watch the motor racing um and uh you know hitting a golf ball uh it's good for the mind body and soul to do something completely different to be to be involved with this intensity of what we've been involved in every single day is not a healthy thing so it's a good thing to get away from it and i know a lot of my friends are doing that but but this is a phony war just like between september 1939 That's and right. 1940 when the country was in this phony war, and 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 our compatriots in those in those months uh, before the blitz started, um, were, were genuinely thinking, you know, what's the problem? There's nothing happening. It's, this is all nonsense. <laughs> and it's, I feel it's exactly the same. That analogy, I think, is exactly what's happening now. It, there will be a trigger moment when a massive shift will happen overnight. Yes. But to get to that point is going to take a long time. You know, I mean, revolutions normally take 20 or 30 years, don't they? But then it suddenly happens. Yeah. Um, and we all know revolutions are not televised. And that's what we're in. That's what we're in here because we're fighting for our way of life because they do not want to let us live the lives that we know is what free British people should be living. And we are not falling for this digital ID. We are not falling for this financial enslavement, which is what the real motivation here is and what is going on. And this is why we do what we do. 